We are here today before God because marriage is one of his most sacred wishes. This occasion marks a celebration of love and commitment with the two of you and in your new life together. Love is patient. Love is kind. It is never jealous. Love is never boastful or conceited. It is never rude or selfish. It does not take offense. It is not resentful. Love takes no pleasure in other people's faults, but delights in the truth. It's always ready to excuse, to trust, to hope. It's always ready to endure whatever comes. True love does not come to an end. Well, Jimmy and Carissa, you know, let me remind you that marriage is a precious gift. It's a lifelong dedication to love, as well as being a daily challenge to love one another fully, freely, and unconditionally. So, Jimmy, with that understanding, I have some questions for you. You, Jimmy, take Carissa to be your beloved wife. Do you promise before God and these witnesses to be a tender and faithful husband? Do you promise to love and cherish her in sickness and in health, for richer or for poorer, for better or for worse, and promise to keep yourself wholly unto her? If so, if you look into her eyes and say, I do. I do. And Carissa, with that same understanding, do you take Jimmy to be your beloved husband? Do you promise before God and these witnesses to be a tender and faithful wife? Do you promise to love and cherish him in sickness and in health, for richer or for poorer, for better or for worse, and promise to keep yourself wholly unto him? If so, if you look into his eyes and say, I do. I do. What therefore God has joined together, let no one separate. You pronounce yourself to be husband and wife, but always remember to be each other's best friend. So now by the authority vested in me by the state of Georgia and Almighty God, I announce with great joy, you are indeed husband and wife. Jimmy, you may now kiss your bride. Ladies and gentlemen, my pleasure to present to you for the first time as husband and wife, Mr. and Mrs. Cusano. Congratulations. Yeah.